And in the veteran community, there's a lot of women who are helping to shed light on female veterans in our community. And one woman has spent years taking it a step further, honoring not just those who've served, but their families even more. It's a lot of work to keep track of the veterans and make sure they're taken care of. I mean, what's probably the most rewarding part of it all? The impact on families. You know me, I'm all about the veterans and the families. Ellen Fuller is a trooper, volunteering hours out of her day, fighting to make sure veterans have a voice. When we came to this community to see how veteran centric and give back it is. It was just such a natural fit for us. One of her first memory serving veterans took place at the Brazos Valley Vietnam Veterans Memorial. Now, this is very special. When they were fixing this area, it told me about an opportunity to do a paver. So I did one in my dad's memory. Her dad's commitment to service is where it all started. Dad was in the Navy and he was on the Enterprise, not the Starship, the first nuclear carrier that went around the world before they left it in Vietnam. But mom was on the home front. She's done everything from collecting names, planning events, finding family members of those still missing in action, all with those who've served in mind. I'm energized by other people that are here that are doing it to be able to say, Thank you, thank you, thank you. Until I see that there might be a need, some way I can help. And yeah, I invite people to come. We need volunteers. Um, and to recognize me, I turn the spotlight, say, yes, you think I do good, come and do better. A humble woman who, much like the men and women who've served, recognized the need to remember those who've put the fight for others before their own recognition. And there's set to be plenty of events honoring veterans in the coming weeks, including one at Veterans Park this Wednesday and the Vietnam Memorial in Bryan the following week.